Peyronie's disease is a chronic debilitating condition associated with severe erectile dysfunction, penile curvature, pain, and progressive loss of penile length over time. Although the exact cause of Peyronie's disease is largely unknown, we think that over time, microtrauma to the penis lays down scar tissue that leads to plaque formation. These plaques can cause pain and curvature of the penis, uh, leading to progressive erectile dysfunction and loss of length. Peyronie's disease causes bothersome deformity of the penis, which can include curvature, narrowing, or pain to the penis. It can make erections difficult as well as can make intercourse prohibitive. Peyronie's disease can be diagnosed by your urologist with a careful history and physical examination. Oftentimes, the penile plaques can be palpable, but more commonly, the patient makes a diagnosis by reporting severe penile curvature or progressive erectile dysfunction with penile pain. There are several different treatment options available for Peyronie's disease. I would like to start by saying I would avoid buying anything online or anything by mouth to take because we know that that will not work. Different treat op treatment options that will work involve straightening the penis or repairing the penile curvature. This can be done with uh, various plication procedures that are used, uh, that, that use sutures uh, to uh, straighten the penis. There are also plaque excision and grafting procedures that can be done, but Oftentimes with Peyronie's disease, the erectile dysfunction is so severe and so progressive and there's such loss of length with Peyronie's that the best option for men with ED associated with Peyronie's will be a penile implant. This both preserves penile length and maintains that length uh, and prevents further loss and also allows for straightening the penis when the implant is placed. Treatment of Peyronie's disease is driven largely by uh, how much erectile dysfunction is present. If a man is potent, he is oftentimes best treated with plication penile straightening procedures. However, if there's already pre-existing erectile dysfunction present, a excising that plaque and grafting it is generally just going to lead to more ED due to uh, venous leak and inability to maintain the erection. Therefore, if men are suffering from both ED and Peyronie's disease, or PD, the best option for them will oftentimes be a penile implant. If left untreated, Peyronie's disease will generally lead to a progressive loss of penile length and worsening of erectile dysfunction. It's important to note that there is an active phase of Peyronie's during the first six to 12 months that's associated with penile pain. During this active early phase, generally uh, you do not try to straighten the penis or do any drastic interventions. However, the patient will then transition into a chronic latent non-painful phase after that initial phase. This is the time where the, the plaque and curvature tend to stabilize and the patient will be left with a, a, either a debilitating curvature or progressive length. And it's at that time where you'd want to focus on straightening the penis or restoring that penile erectile function. 